Hi, my name is Rita Hanninen and I work for the Four Deserts Race Team and I'm here currently in Ecuador preparing for the 2015 rowing race. I've got here with me Felipe Meneses who's a part of our local team and Felipe has lived all his life here in this environment in the Cotopaxi National Park ar and around Quito. So he is going to tell us a little bit more about altitude and how to prepare for it. Thank you Rita. Hi everybody. Um, Altitude, basically, in Ecuador gets to be something very, very common. Uh, it's a very, very high country. Our highest point in Ecuador is the uh, Mount Chimborazo. That's like about uh, 6,310 meters. Um, in the course, we're not going to go nearly as high. Like our highest point is going to be about like 3,800 meters at the most. And probably like the lowest is going to be like around uh, 2,400 meters. You know, so um, coming from uh, the coast or areas that are lowlands, you know, like uh, they get to be like below like 2,000 meters, it might be like a little bit difficult to cope with the altitude. The best ways to do it is if you get to come a little bit in early, you know, like stay like in a city like Quito that has like a lot of volcanoes, a lot of uh, trails and a lot of places that go like uh, as high or even higher than the race. By doing this uh, and sleeping in altitude, your red blood cells will be getting uh, to be produced at night, like eat like a lot of iron, you know, like uh, keep hydrated. You know, that's like uh, something that would be like uh, a very important factor on the survival of the race. So um, I guess uh, some of the extra stuff uh, that you could uh, do, you know, like uh, as particular tips, you know, like visit the uh, volcano Pichincha, visit the Pasochoa, visit the Cotopaxi, go to the Ilinisas, you know, and then like um, little day trips, you know, that can actually help you to to be around uh, here in a more pleasant way. Okay, so basically come to Ecuador a little bit earlier, spend night sleep over in the altitude, um, do some day trips if you can, uh, and drink a lot of water. Is there anything else we should think about? Well, a lot of people, you know, they like to uh, have like uh, drinks like coca tea, like sunfo tea, and little things like this, right? But like if you get to train, you know, I guess, the training will be like the best way like to be fit for the race you know and then like come a little bit early just so you know what to expect thanks very much felipe see you next year in ecuador bye